Hello everyone, welcome to another interesting and wonderful video tutorial. Here I'll be showing you how to trim objects in Corel Draw. Like I always say, it's very simple and um, very easy to do. Alright, um, before we um, proceed, um, if this is your first time visiting my channel, do well to hit on the subscribe button and turn on the post notification bell to get notified when I post new videos. Alright, so let's begin. Okay, um... I'll be showing you how to trim objects in Corel Draw here. Alright, so let's create an ellipse here. We'll make use of random shapes here. Alright. So create another shape here. Alright. Then you highlight it. Then you go to the standard bar. Then you see trim. Cut a portion of an object by using the shape of another object. Alright. As you can see it has been trimmed okay all right so you can try this with another shape let's try it with another shape now let's delete this okay let's make use of a square here it's a page then um let's choose from let's make use of a star here all right all right so Let's give it a color first. And let's say this should be red. Alright. Remove outline. None. Alright. Okay. Then um one thing um uh, about trimming objects is that just make sure the object you want it um uh, you want to trim should be below the object that you want it to assume the shape. Alright. So you highlight it, then you trim. As you can see, that's as look at it here. That's a zoom the shape. This uh, most uh, applicable when you want to create um logos or basic shapes. Okay, another is um let's take for example, let's create this common shapes. Then you can select. Let's make use of um. A love shape here all right okay let's delete this all right so let's use um darker red for this all right move outline okay so we want to trim this now all right want to cut um half part of this uh, circle okay so depending on what angle you are coming from all right so hold it then trim as you can see half part of the circle has been trimmed off but what if you just want a slash a line this um, a space between the um, the the love shape here so this is how you do it or like a cut um, in the love shape here so this is what you do now and you click on this then um, duplicate this depending on how wide you want it and you give let's say uh, green and highlight it highlight then um, trim okay and you delete remove outline none so then um this is how you do it now. Bring it here, highlight, then trim. As you can see, this is it here. This is it. Then you break it, Control key. That means um, you can give it, you can apply different colors to it. Alright, so let's try this one again. Alright, let's try here again. Alright, just follow the same process, then um, standard bar, trim, and you break it, control key, or you go to um, object, then um, go to object, then break cover part, control key, whichever one, and let's see this red, okay, let's give it black, black will be more preferable, yeah, so then um, you zoom, so it depends on the object or any shape you want to achieve so you just follow this process 
then you can achieve whatever you want all right um let's try another one here again um you can make use of the two point line tool here all right so let's give an example okay we'll make use of the shape let's use a polygon here one of the polygon shapes here okay so let's use this two point line shape here all right i'll just draw here then um you highlight then um you trim and you break ctrl k and you delete this give it a color and um, give it a color you can separate it if you want to make use of this one depending on your choice or what you want okay um another one is um just a random shape here or let's say let's make use of an oval yeah okay then you give it a color then um just create a shape here all right then um, highlight everything here so let's do away with this delete highlight it here then um then trim here so key to break it apart and you can make use of it any which of your choice whichever thing you want to use it to achieve and you can make use of it all right guys um that is it on how to trim objects in coral draw it's very simple and um very easy to do all right if you don't understand um, anything or if you are if you have any question do what to reach me in the comment section below see you on the next video tutorial thank you for watching